Hey guys, it's Chugga Conroy, here to start my next playthrough and everything, that the one that you guys voted for the most, Paper Mario, and yep, that's Virtual Console, alright, no homebrew here, yeah, but then again, you guys have no real way of knowing. Alright, let's get the show on the road. You will need the class controller. Screw you, I'm using the GameCube controller. Come on. Actually, uh, before I started this recording, I uh, tripped over my GameCube controller cord while it was plugged into my Wii and it knocked my whole console over. I have done that probably five or six times since I got my Wii when it came out, and God, that, that's one complaint I have with the Wii's design. Anyway, we have a story here. Today, I'm going to tell you the story of Star Spirits and Good Wishes. Far, far away, beyond the sky, way above the clouds. It's been said that there's a haven where the stars live. Sanctuary of Star Haven. There rests a fabled treasure called the Star Rod, from Kirby, which has the power to grant all wishes. Using the wondrous Star Rod, the seven revered star spirits watched over our peaceful world. Carefully, very carefully. And then... OH MY GOD, SCOTCH TAPE! Oh dear, what the... Who stuck that weird thing into the story? HA HA HA! YEAH, I DID IT! WAH HA 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 HA! So I can at long last beat my arch enemy Mario, I'll take this star rod! Do it, Kami Koopa! No, you mustn't do that! Yeah, now let's try using it! I'm doing this based on a Super Mario Sunshine voice. <laughs> Stop it! Cut it out, Bowser! You're changing the story! Wahaha! We did it! That was a piece of cake! Wahaha! Now Star Kids may rise to the haven to deliver people's wishes. But those wishes will not come true. Whatever can they do? One of the last N64 games ever released, Paper Mario, developed by Nintendo and Intelligent Systems. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and start up a new file right here. Ah, what the heck, I'll use my... Nah, nah. I like my real name too much, I can't just use Chugga. What kind of guy do you think I am? Anyway, um, I do feel kind of unfair starting this playthrough, though, because, you know, uh, Koshimaru is already doing his, you know, if any of you guys know who Koshimar is, but, um, you know, he, uh, is taking a break from his and everything that, and I've been playing this game a lot longer, like, way before he even started his, and he's taking a break from his right now, anyway. And there is the mailman. Mail call! I wish I had a flying mailman. Got, what is it with Nintendo games and flying mailman? I mean, seriously, you got Paper Mario, you got Zelda the Wind Waker, you got... Well, it's all the games in general, I guess, but, you know. Hey, Mario! We got the letter from Princess Beach! Okay, I won't do the voices all the time. Typical stuff, you know. Mario's mute in this game, you know, like most... Like most... Alright. Let's see what this letter says! It's from Peach. Just like Super Mario 64. And Super Mario Galaxy. And... Some other games. I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I'd be honored if you could both attend. Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. Ooh, entertainment. <laughs> I hope to see you here soon. Sincerely, Peach. Okay. Wow, gee, for such a dark intro and everything, this game sure is starting out happy. Dang. Anyway, though, uh, yeah. Actually, I wasn't really counting on this game to win the poll. I was expecting you guys to, uh... I was expecting you guys probably to pick Pokemon, though, but, eh, I'm cool with it. Paper Mario is still one of my most loved games of all time. I have all three games in the series. <sighs> and here's BR Peach's Castle. I like how Peach's Castle in this game is, like, reminiscent of Mario 64. What? That magnificent castle. I can never use this place. Looks like lots of guests are already here. Whatever. Okay. You know, a lot of these doors are locked. A lot of them won't open for you. It's pretty reminiscent, it's pretty accurate, I mean, there you got the bomb on the battlefield, the up here. You know, no Bowser door, unfortunately. <laughs> anyway, though. Who's this one? Fart right here. Greetings, Mario. I'm the Minister of Princess Peach's Castle. It's good to see you here. When you're around, it feels like our kingdom is secure. Yep, the future looks great. Okay. Here is a little secret right here. Already a secret, wow. 
Okay, this is Princess Peach's room. If you keep talking to this guy, he'll eventually let you in. And there's only two times the entire game you can come into this room as Mario. You'll see what I mean later. But yeah, there's really nothing special here, it's just a little thing. A frame photo of Mario! That was kind of disturbing. Anyway, though, um, enough dilly dallying around. We're gonna go ahead and get going. How was it? To tell you the truth, I've never seen the inside of her room. Ha <laughs> ha! I've seen the inside, you haven't. Controls are typical, you know, press A to jump. You have a spin dash in this game. Yes, I think Mario was getting a little jealous of Sonic the Hedgehog as they were still competing at this point in time. Ah, oh, God. Spin dash! Spin dashing! I wish I was Sonic! Or whatever. Oh, Mario, you came to the party to see me. You're so sweet. Thank you. And a heart that is not legible. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. Oh, you poor baby, having to greet people. And sit on your ass the rest of the day on your throne. Nobody will bother us here. Shall we relax and chat, just the two of us? It was lovely today, so I'm sure it'll be comfortable out on the balcony right now. Will you accompany Mario? No! Eh, hey, she's gonna make me anyway. Oh, looks like I'm getting out easy on this one. Earthquake! Oh god, what's going on? Paper trees! Whoa. Yeah, so, gee, I wonder whose castle this is. Got enough, like... I like how this uh, castle like, has the Koopa Clan car propping it up. It's kind of cool, actually. This is so like the beginning of Super Mario Galaxy. Oh, are you alright? What in the world was that? And she hops up. Oh my, look, Mario! It's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see stars outside! No shit. Sorry, I didn't mean to cuss right there. That's not really my style. <laughs> Long time no see, Princess Peach. Bowser! But it can't be! It was you that made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? Whatever did you do? Wahaha! -ha -ha! He says with his text rolling. Yeah, it was me. I lifted your castle up into the sky. It's sitting on my castle now. We weren't expecting that, huh? Actually, no, I wasn't. Ha! This castle's under my control now, my dear. You Now you will obey me. <laughs> huh? What? It's Mario! What a shock! Ha! Not really. I expected you to turn up red on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Unfortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you just give up already? Yeah, seriously. It's like the over 9,000th time that he's tried. True, true, I have had my problems in the past, but this time is different. This time, I'm gonna win! Okay, tough guy, let's go! Alright, our first battle, and... First boss battle, technically. Mario tripped on the way in. Mario, you can do it! Okay! Looks like all we're allowed to do in the first battle is jump. Let's do it. Let's do it. Beep. Peach gets all scared whenever Mario takes damage. Mm -hmm. All right, Bowser. Come on, keep jumping on him. No, you really can't do that in the other games. Good old Mario, always fighting. You're a thorn in my side. For the day, you pathetic little attacks won't beat me. Take a look at this! Look what I stole from Star Haven! It's the Star Rod! More like I stole from Kirby. This fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole wide world. And when I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat me, Mario! Actually, when I first played the original Super Smash Brothers, I had never played a Kirby game at the time, so I thought the Star Rod was taken from Paper Mario. Uh, which is kind of funny. Anyway, his attacks now do more damage to us, of course, three damage. Come on! Attack him! Mario, you can win! Gwaha! That's not all you got out sad. You'd best take some vitamins, because that didn't hurt at all! Alright. I'm just gonna tell you right now, there is no possible way that you can win this fight. It's just always a loss, no matter what you did. Yep, just as I expected, Mario's no match for the new me. It's not even worth my time to toy with you anymore, Mario. It's time to end this. Here we go, Mario! Good night! And that would've killed us in one hit. I don't get why you just didn't do that from the beginning, but okay. Oh no, 
Mario, get up! Yes! Oh yeah, I did it! I finally did it! I beat my old rival Mario! Yes! Congratulations on your victory, your viciousness. That's why you're the king. That old Mario's no match for the king! As long as I have the star red, everything I wish for will come true. No one can stop me now. Why doesn't he just wish that we're dead? Oh, well, I guess I might get rid of Mario. He's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. A lot of people have wondered what happens if you actually hack the game and beat him. It actually, the game just freezes. Because there's nothing for that. Oh no, Mario! And Kamikuba blabs off to those guys. Well, alright, we're gonna leave this off here, alright? So, if you like this part, subscribe to my videos up in the corner, big yellow button, giving you 5 star views, download this video, be sure to come out parts if you like this one, okay? I will see you guys later. And the title. Oh my god, I've been playing Paper Mario this whole time? I never would have guessed.